Welcome back to another installment of Nightmares and News. I'm your host, Bumps in the Night, and here's the news. Spirit Halloween is now selling a fog-spewing replica of the atomic ray gun from Attack on Mars. After releasing a six-foot-tall Martian warrior animatronic last year, Spirit Halloween is back this year with another brand new item for fans of the Mars Attacks trading card slash movie. Straight from the cult classic Mars Attacks, up for grabs recently, the officially licensed atomic ray gun prop features functioning fog, intergalactic lights, and sound. The Atomic Ray Gun also comes with a black light activated collectible poster. Spirit Halloween previews The Martians have returned to cause complete mayhem this Halloween. Did we mention they're armed? Prepare yourself for the Mar Martian invasion this Halloween by strapping yourself up with this officially licensed Atomic Ray Gun. The Atomic Ray Gun prop is just like the one the Martians used to vaporize any humans that got in their way of the global destruction. You'll be equipped to survive any Martian attack once you get your hands on one for yourself. Using the included refillable water tank, you can refill your weapon of destruction whenever you're getting low on juice. Featuring intergalactic sounds along with a blue LED light-up barrel and a green LED light-up nozzle that shoots actual fog mist when turned on, you can grab yours today for $129.99 USD over on SpiritHalloween.com. The year, 1988. The destination, Fear Street. You heard us right, Netflix has released the first look at their new upcoming film, Fear Street 1988 Prom Queen. The fourth installment in the Fear Street series is currently in development. Venture back to 1988 Prom Night and this upcoming adaptation to the hit horse series, Fear Street, brought to you from Netflix. Watch Errol Stein's work come to life with killer intent. Are you looking forward to the next installment in this series? We know we sure are. Fear Street 1988 Prom Night is expected to drop sometime in late 2024. Hold on to your heads because the Sleepy Hollow remake awakens at Paramount Pictures. In 2022, Paramount Pictures first announced its plans to remake the classic Washington Irving tale, Sleepy Hollow, with filmmaker Lindsay Anderson Beer at the helm. Now after a two-year slumber, the project is moving forward once again. Beer, known for her work on Pet Cemetery Bloodlines, is set to write and direct and produce this haunting new adaptation, bringing her unique vision of the legend of the Headless Horseman to life. We haven't seen anything done with the franchise since Tim Burton's take on the story way back in the 90s. Are you excited to see a new spin on this classic tale? We know we sure are. We'll keep you updated on these eerie developments as they emerge. Official Funko video game Funko Fusion unites properties including The Thing and Jaws. Funko and 1010 Games have announced upcoming video game Funko Fusion recently. And much to our delight, the game is absolutely loaded with Funko Pop style horror icons. The official trailer for Funko Fusion heavily features John Carpenter's The Thing, as well as 1999's The Mummy, Jaws, Jurassic World, and even Jordan Peele's Nope. Other horror properties including Megan, Shaun of the Dead, Five Nights at Freddy's, Jurassic Park, and Chucky have also been confirmed in Funko Fusion. Funko Fusion is coming to PC, PlayStation 4, and 5. Xbox Series, and Nintendo Switch on September 13th, 2024. Pre-orders for the physical console editions of the game are now available, today at select global retailers, with pre-orders opening across the digital storefronts very soon. Funko Fusion is an action-adventure single-player and online co-op experience. Players will celebrate their favorite movies and TV series across a wide range of more than 20 franchises, from blockbuster movies to hit TV series. Are you looking forward to this game? We've actually recently started collecting Funkos, so we plan to pick it up. Chucky Season 4 Did you know you can help make Chucky Season 4 happen? Yes, you heard us right, Chucky Season 4. Call this number and let the executives know you want it. See, Chucky Season 3 finale closed some doors and opened several others, delivering a widely satisfying final hour that we won't spoil for anyone who hasn't been able to watch it yet. On that note, the Season 3 finale is now streaming on Peacock, so get on it. The Chucky 3 Season finale ended with the lovable killer doll breaking the fourth wall and directly addressing the fans officially announcing that he'll be running for a fourth term. In line with the season's White House setting, Chucky's bid for the fourth term was essentially Domasini's fun way of saying he'd love to do a fourth season, but it sounds like Chucky fans are going to have to let their voices be heard if they share that same desire. To quote, Tonight I am proud to officially announce my candidacy for a fourth consecutive term, Chucky revealed in the final moments of the season finale. Donations to my campaign can be made directly to the number you now see on screen. If you have any doubts at all, I ask you please consider the many accomplishments of my highly successful third term. Thank you, good night, and God bless each and every one of you, except Devin. The number that flashed on screen? 201-500-3347. Calling the number will deliver a short message from Chucky to your phone. From this we gather that Chucky hasn't been officially renewed for a fourth season but the creative team is hoping that enough fans will show up and make sure it does happen soon. So call that number, share the graphic, and let's bring Chucky back to television. That's all the news I have for you today, my lovely fiends. Stay spooky, keep your claws sharp, and consume more souls of the living. 
I've been your host, Bumps in the Night, and remember, horror is a beautiful thing. Thanks for watching, and we'll scare you in the next one.